no one knows it, but evil devils live here. They take souls for their master. Because of them, the world is in terror. Now, after 50 years of slumber, a young demon has awoken. And his name is... Akuman! Give me your soul! Hello everybody, I, I am Obey Clake and welcome to a Let's Play on Go Go Ackman with a Super Famicom. Yes, this game was never released for the Super Nintendo. However, it is fan translated, so watch this damn animation here because I don't know. It's gonna pretty much give you a good assumption of how this game's gonna play out. Also gives me time to talk about, you know. Who's the art director, or what's this game inspired by? Is actually by Akira Toriyama. Akira Toriyama. If you don't know who Akira Toriyama is, he's the guy who did the Dragon Balls and the Dragon Ball Zs and the Dragon Quests and the Chrono Triggers. Well, at least his art direction, anyways. But this is actually one of his short stories, so yeah. And uh, Gogo Ekman is um just here up if you Google it on YouTube uh, or if you YouTube it, type in Gogo Ekman anime. Let me just skip that. Nope, too late. Uh, you'll see some pretty fucking funny anime based on how the manga's supposed to be. You're not supposed to see that. It's a stage you're not supposed to see yet. So let me show you options real quick. You got easy, normal, attack, jump, bump, dash, moat, sound, exit. That's it. I mean, that's, that's all the options. I always go to options, but you know. Anyways. Dark Prince Ackman walk together souls for Satan. What? A nightmare? But Tenshi tried to stop Ackman. I can't stand such an evil devil! But all... But Ackman always wins. Um... So Tenshi got the help from the Angel Army to defeat Ackman. <laughs> now you die. Why did I give him the super sexy voice? Yeah! I have trouble keeping the same voices when I'm swapping for each voice character because I haven't done it for so long or practice it. But anyways, Angel's Test. I already forgot how to do Eggman's voice. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, let's see. How about I just give him a voice that I always do that I get, it's easy for me to do? Because he's going to be talking a lot. I'll borrow the Angel Army, but I'm not sure there'll be enough. Nah, it don't fit, huh? Hey, yo, the best hitman, right? Actually, I'll just give him my voice. Yeah, hit the nail on the head. I never miss my target, and my mother punch has great power. Also, I have completed many jobs. Oh, that's just great! Please kill that man. Sure, but my fee is three thousand yen a minute. Three thousand yen per minute? So, just five minutes is... Stand, J.R. Alright, let's go! Again? Tenshi said to come at two o'clock. Again? You'll never learn. What do we do? I'll play. He's a knight. I'll play. He's a knight. I'll play. Alright, let's go! Why did I give your demon collecting jar sidekick a voice? Anyways, quick, talk about this game real quick. About the buttons anyways. You got jump, you got kick, you got bomb. I'm not gonna use it because that's a bomb. A bomb button is your A button. So B is jump. Y is tech. And B is bomb. Wait, no. A is bomb. I'm trying to remember the freaking controls for fucking Super Nintendo because Xbox is A, B, Y, X. But Super Nintendo is B, A, Y, X. Anyways, you press down, you press attack, you do this, and if you press jump, you do a slide attack. You can't slide on slope, so... I guess slide attacks doesn't hit people anymore. But anyways! So, you can also jump on the angels. I don't know why you can't jump on the foxes, but yeah. I haven't played this game in the longest time. Blonk. Blonk. It's really, um, 
kind of innovative, but... I don't know. When I first started browsing the internet, or when I first started the internet, or got into emulation, I, went to, I used to go to this website called VG Future. By the way, I just got invincibility. So, yeah. If you're wondering when that was. Yoink. And there's this one dude who, uh... I'm just gonna try to sum this up, because I don't want to, you know, dwell on that. But he's like... We used to do, like, these comic sprite things. This is when spriting was very uh, popular back in the day. Like, very popular. Way be Like, this is how... Original the characters happened with Sonic recolors and Mega Man recolors. And I just hit my headset, so now I can only hear from one ear. Fuck. Give me a moment real quick. Shouldn't take me that long. Okay, maybe it might take me a little bit longer than I thought. Shit, fuck it. Whatever. One ear it is. So, anyways. Uh, he had this one character named Ace. And he called- well, he named this dude Ace. Even though his name is Ackman here. So, he just called him Ace, so. Sorry, Bungie, you freaking foxy motherfucker. I'm like, where is he from? I know you didn't create him. Like, nah, I just got it from a game. It's called Akron. There's something down there. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Ugh, I should've stuck with the gun. Alright, I hate this jump. I always remember this jump and I hate it so much. But anyways, I got the sword. And there's- a Oh, there's one more attacker for it to show. Let me see if I can make this jump though. Yay! Okay, holding the L button, which is dash, which is always run. Because if you don't hold it, you have to you have a small momentous run in here. I can barely make that jump. This game has jumps. Those precision jumps. This is, this is what this game has. <laughs> and this is what makes it hard. That and like the hit detection, but... So, pretty much it's just... I don't know. I would just say, you know... Be safe. I hate the sword though. Where did I get it? Ah oh, man. And he's still lived! Why I hate the sword is because he swings up. Like in a diagonal. I'm gonna risk it. Oh, should I risk it? Okay. There's something coming up that I didn't want to risk. I only remember the first stage so much because I used to play this first stage so much because I died so much. It was when I first started emulating and I sucked bad. I'm scared to do this. Not fall down. It's uh, getting this weapon. It's a good weapon. It's one of my favorite weapons. It doesn't circle you, but you can only use it once. But the way I use it, it's pretty cool. So you gotta, I gotta make that jump back there. I can't make that jump up here. And this is my problem. You see them? You see them? Yeah. They're just gonna keep falling on me. And I'm gonna die. That's why they give you the extra life. They're like, here you dumb fuck. Alright, see if I can do this. Here's my plan. I hate it though. No! It didn't come out fast enough. Oh well. Nah, I lost both bombs. And I need the lives. Ah, damn it. So in the part. Okay, in part two. You can swap out the weapons you get from your gun to sword to boomerang. Okay, he's always there. And I hate you can't do it in part one. But part one's the only one that's been fan translated because part two and three were never fan translated. However, I did play part two and three because, I don't know, I just like the game. I just like playing this game. It helps that it's a cure Toriyama. I ain't going for that shit anymore. If I had save states, I'd do it. But I'm not gonna try my best not to use save states. This game has a life system and it has a continue system. Then you can only continue twice. I don't remember how many times you can continue. Oh yeah, the next attack is just hold the attack button, and you can do a charge fist arc. This game is- This game is easy hard. Like, it's so easy to die, but it's so easy to, like, to not die. It's one of those, like... I can't explain that well. It's like Super Mario Bros. Super Mario, Super Mario Brothers is easy to play. Like, literally easy to play. Anyone can get it. But it's also easy for you to die because it's so easy to play. And I think this game at the second stage, well, at the fourth on the fourth transition, that's when it becomes like really fucking hard. At least I think so. This game does pick up. But other than that, um Kiritorian, man. I haven't really met his uh, short story on Act Man, I just play the game. Uh, but <laughs> when I was going on YouTube, I could fall that sort. Yeah. Uh, I discovered there's an anime short. I don't know if there's, I don't know if it's long or anything, but it's a short. It's called uh, Go, well, Go Go Act Man. And more dialogue, I think. Yep. Welcome. This time you die, Act Man. I hired the world's best hitman, Mr. Yamada. Please. Two hours, five minutes, one minute more. Nothing against you, but I'm going to kill you. Yeah. And then, bam. He's gonna move. 
And there you go. Oh, thing. It got you nine, three hits, yo! Alright, it's four hits. I don't know, I remember the boss is dying real easily, but they're also really... They can easily kill you. This is what I mean by, like, everyone's on an equal level here, in the sense of how easy it is for you to die and, you know, beat it. Damn it! I'll show you! And wait! Let's play some more! Even though in anime or, you know, Japan, they have, like, high-pitched voices and stuff like that. Anyways, where did that tent you run off to? Mm, looks like you left a car over there. Alright, let's use it to catch up. Let's trample that angel army. <laughs> I'm gonna die doing these voices. Especially his. Anyways, he painted Ekman on his car. So this is one of the hardest parts of the stage. Honestly, I think so, because it's kind of it's kind of like playing Battletoads. Anyways, you need these little minefields. They're not gonna hurt you, but you need them. God damn it. Okay, good. I remember retrying this stage so many times. This is why I remember I'm doing level 1 so much. Because of this fucking stage. It's straight up trial and error. Ah, damn it. Ah, damn it. I don't know why the other ones didn't pop me up, though. Oh, man. I hate this stage so damn much. It's like... We're still doing, like, level 1, by the way. You're not supposed to jump when you touch the mine. You just, you know, just get on top of it. And it just jumps for you. But the other ones didn't do it. It's weird. Odd. Queer. And whatever thing words I can't think of right now that mean weird. That one did it. That's weird. Maybe it's because I, maybe because I jumped on top of it. Anyways, it, you seem like, oh, this doesn't seem so hard. Actually, you see that right there? It's gonna get more of that. But I remember this one jump that really fucked me over. There's other levels that do this too, by the way. And they didn't pop me on this time. <laughs> I'm gonna use my first continue already. I'm not. I'm not lying. Though. This is where I'm gonna like suck the most. These stages. God damn. I think it's just easier to just stay on the mines, but it's not really. You really want to stay on the bottom. It's trial and error of the game. I hope I. Well, this part. Trial and error of the stage. I really hope that I remember. Cause I remember this one jump you have to do. Very fucking tricky. That, uh, <laughs> I hope I remember where it is. Because holy shit. Anyways, that item there, the one that looked like the bottom and stuff, that is a full health recovery, I believe. Alright. Okay, I'll take, I'll take three hits if I have to. Well, I'm gonna die already. Could've used that full health recovery earlier. And we're getting to the... Okay, slow down from the game. I'm getting to the point where... No! <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, here it comes, here it comes. I hated that jump so much. I'm on my last life, too. There's another trick jump here, I believe. I don't know if there's another part of the stage in the game. Okay, I did it. I'm barely dying, and I'm dying so bad. I'm barely dying, I'm dying. No! Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, full health recovery. Sweet. I'm gonna use this. Ugh. You can't hit him when he turns red. Yeah. Oh, I got so lucky. I'm just gonna run up to him. God damn it, Firefox. I don't wanna die. He's gonna jump. Ah, damn it. <laughs> die already, please. Oh, what is that? That is called luck. Luck resides within me. Grab that stupid soul already. I could have used this, but. Yeah. Well, anyways, I got a health upgrade, so that's neat. I think when I use continue, it's gone, but I'm not sure. Anyways! Akman won the first battle against the angels. But Tenshi would not give up so easily. What dreadful plan will he think of next? It's not over yet, Akman! Show me on the next part of Let's Play Go Go Akman with me, your Piffly, Kizzix Boy!